Yeah, I mean, I think I think I can speak for myself and what what I've seen out of Johnny. I, I think we've done a great job. We got a lot of young guys, and we've kind of been leading by example, starting in the spring where it was just a few guys on campus. Well, some people went home a lot. Me, Johnny, Carter Gilmore, Brad, a bunch of the freshmen from last year and sophomore stayed and lifted where we when we weren't when we didn't have to be there. And I think. That just uh, progressed into the summertime and just the hard work that has been put into the summer it just uh, kind of follows from the leadership in us three. You? Oh, wait, what was the question? <laughs> How have you feel like you've handled your new role as a leader, especially so young? Um, I think I think I'm doing a pretty good job at it so far. Um, I did it in high school for four years. Uh, no, I'm just looking forward to playing with these guys this year. And then Brad, for you, like I said, you've been in this role. How has your role kind of like transitioned to more, not as a mentor to these two specifically? It's been an awesome experience. You know, both of them do a great job, not only leading by example and leaving it all during the floor, whether in the weight room, on the court, uh, but they've also with their voice. They've really stepped up, you know, holding other people accountable, encouraging other people. So for me, I just kind of taken a step back and let them do their thing, you know, Kind of serve as a mentor if you want to say that but really just thankful to be along in the journey with them and allow you know us three to make this team what it is and to set new standards and like i said we have a really great group of guys a lot of young guys that are eager to learn eager to work um and that's you know that's spearheaded by these two guys so just thankful to be a part of it and then the other thing you guys had a lot of turnover on your team this year you you three are the biggest returners most productive returners i should say um, what's the team identity looking like so far? Like, what is the theme for this year, and what are your goals for this year? So the team identity is right. Everyone knows that we're really young. We don't have a whole lot of experience. That's the narrative you all hear. But part of what comes with that is we have a lot of young guys that are really hungry to not only get better, but to prove themselves each and every day and leave it all up on the floor and work hard and play hard um, and have a lot of fun doing it. So I think our identity is just that, you know, we're never going to go away. We're going to keep, we're going to be gritty. We're going to be scrappy um, and we're going to take care of the little things. And we're going to, again, like I said, just leave it all out there because of the joy that we have playing the game. And then Tyler, for you, um, what are some of those goals that you have set for yourself as you head into your junior season? Sorry, what was that? Goals you've set for yourself as you head into your junior season. I mean, my goals are always to go out there and not necessarily have statistical stat line goals, but I just want to go out there and win. And that's something that Wisconsin has kind of prided, it, prided itself on, where they don't have necessarily a guy that's going out there scoring 30 points a game, but they have a bunch of guys that really care about the program and care about each other and want to go out there and win some games. And then Johnny, for you, you just you want a gold medal with FIBA Unite, the Team USA team. Um, how has that experience kind of helped you um, start practices and get into the flow of things? Uh, it's boosted my confidence a lot. Uh, playing over there with those guys overseas, it's not easy. They play a different style of basketball, and I thought I handled it pretty well. And then last one for you guys. How have the eight new players kind of adapted? If you want to hit them all, that would be great, <coughs> and whoever wants to talk, that would be fantastic. Uh, they've done a great job. You know, we got a lot of new faces. You know, we got three transfers. We got some new freshmen. Um, they've all hit the ground running, and they're doing things the right way and taking this right approach. Um, you know, we start like we got a freshman guard, Chucky Hepburn. You know, really good with the ball, really dynamic. Just love the way he values defense. Um, so he's he, he's been good. Uh, Marcus Ilver, another freshman. Uh, man, he offensively is really really talented. His ability to make plays and stretch the floor. Um, Anybody else want to take any other guys? Um, Chris Vogt, our big transfer from Cincinnati, has been good. It's just another. It's nice to have another older, big body that's kind of seen some, been around for a while, and some seen some bigger guys. So he's been doing well, kind of a big presence in the game. Um, I, I really don't got nothing to say about anybody specifically. <laughs> uh, you know, I think all the guys are doing well, uh, transitioning from where they were at last year into this year. Awesome. Thanks, guys.